Welcome back to Music News TV. This is Tim Hunter. Today's music news. Unfortunately for you guys that are fans of a romantic tale and a happy ending, one of our favorite rappers had decided to end his marriage. That would be rapper Young Jeezy. His marriage to uh, Jenny May, the TV talk show host, unfortunately has come to a demise. Uh, Jeezy filed for divorce and he filed irreconcilable differences. Um, as you guys know or don't know, they met in like 2018 through a mutual friend and he just hit it off so well that after about three years, actually in 2021, they decided to jump the broom. To a lot of people dismay, as a matter of fact, I think. A lot of people ruled them on, of course, but some close friends, the scene of Jenny May, wasn't too happy about that. But nonetheless, I think everyone wished them well and they went on ahead and moved forward. A year later, they had a daughter, Monaco. 2022, I believe, right? Now it's 2023, so you have a one-year-old and you have five years under your belt. What could have made him decide to file for a divorce just that fast? It had to be something very detrimental and something that he just couldn't see himself dealing with. Um, when you say irreconcilable differences, uh, that don't just mean that you guys have difference of opinion or don't get along anymore. Uh, a lot of times, it could be infidelity, meaning that you someone's cheating on someone, but you put irreconcilable differences because that's very hard to prove unless you got concrete, you know, evidence there. So I don't know what's going to happen yet because it seemed like it was a rash decision. This type of thing that normally happens in most marriages after something awful happens and there's such an argument or a bad energy space there that you just seem like you're not thinking all the way through and you don't think you can recover. And it could be something as detrimental as that. Nonetheless, uh, Jesus seemed like a very wise person for such a young guy he is. It's just unfortunate that he decided to make a decision like this. If you guys don't know, most women in America are the ones that file divorce. So normally when the men file divorce, there's something about that that he just can't handle. I definitely understand that. But nonetheless, let's keep those guys in prayers or whatever. And hopefully, maybe, you know, they can work things out. If nothing else, they have a child together. I'm sure they're going to be on the best of terms. In the meanwhile, I'll keep you guys posted on what's going on there. It just seems like the story is not over. Nonetheless, thanks for tuning in. This is Tim Hunter. Subscribe and like. Bring more news later.